Mark Henry Venani says once elected to power, he will usher the country in what he termed minimum government to a maximum governance, meaning a reduced cabinet, but with high service delivery to the masses. Venani has also vowed to lead on the front line to attack all forms of corruption and consolidate all resources that he says benefited only a few elites so that it can benefit the population. This, he says, will be done by setting up at least one value addition factory in every constituency so that raw materials are not exported, thereby creating jobs for Namibians. I want to urge Namibians in your thousand to remain calm, to remain resilient, to remain more than ever vigilant. We must remain vigilant because the buffalo is wounded. The buffalo is severely wounded, and if we look at the first exit polls, PDM has already broken the two-third majority. We broke the first two-third majority in the first exit poll, and we are marching forward to break the two-third majority. And I, under your watch, will break the two-third majority, and we are going to deliver a better country. We are going to train farmers in farm resettlement. Among other ambitious promises, he says his government will reduce taxes for companies in order to attract foreign direct investment, reduce time it takes to register a company to only five days, create employment for unexperienced young people by giving them in-service training. We shall not discriminate against those that are falling in the category of LGBTs. We shall respect their right and they shall enjoy their freedoms in the country of their birth. We shall not trample on the rights of any sector of our society. We shall not pursue tribalism in our government. We shall not pursue regionalism in our government. Nepotism, corruption, all those vices shall be rejected by a new order. We shall bring in an order that serves the interests of the people of our country in unity and in diversity. But we shall save, and my transformational leadership shall serve this country with honor, humility, dedication, and a cause for service delivery. Venani says PDM will also tackle the water crisis to boost agriculture by installing a water dam in each village. PDM will cut on the defense bill and divert it to agriculture, education, health, and SME loans without collateral. I'm going to province Namibians on the peripheries of our cities across Namibia, in our towns, in our rural villages. We shall provide every family with a running toilet that we can deliver. That we can deliver. Even if it has to cost me stay selling the presidential near jet to start the project of one family, one toilet, I shall do it. Daniel Nadunya, NBC News, Ventura.